Welcome to the BuildTrack 50 paid subscription overview. With a low price yearly subscription, you'll be able to search and track over 220,000 state and federal bills, create and save your bill sheets, set up bill alerts for mobile devices, auto-generate bill tracking widgets to install on your website, build share stakeholder pages, and much, much more. First, you'll need to register with BuildTrack 50. This gives you access to either the free quick searches or the full function paid subscription features. Click on register and just enter your first and last name, email address, screen name and password and you are all set. Let's create a new bill sheet. Enter the bill sheet name and the states you'd like to track, either manually or by clicking the button to the right. In this example, let's track California, Colorado and Texas. But let's look for bills that contain the text renewable energy and contain either solar or wind. Click on Next for pricing options. With BuildTrack 50, you have three options. You can track the three selected states on unlimited bill sheets at just $500 per state or $1,500 for the year in this example. You can have unlimited number of states on bill sheets at $500 each, or you can have unlimited number of states and unlimited bill sheets for just $3,000 per year. Pricing is for the calendar year, and we have prorated it, so you only have to pay for how much of the year is left. We mail you an invoice so that you have a chance to try out the bill sheet before we charge you. You are not required at any time to pay with a credit card online. Select the option that suits you best and click on Next. Enter your billing address by filling out your address, city, state, and zip code. Verify your new bill sheet configuration at the bottom. And if it all looks good, accept the terms of use and click on Purchase. Here is the bill sheet where you'll see all the filtered bills in the three states that we selected. There are 14 fields such as state, bill number, session, bill name, sponsors, etc. And we've included five customizable column fields. Each can be resized and the list can be sorted by clicking on the column field. Let's go to the settings button at the bottom to configure the bill sheet. Here you can configure which field is visible and the header text to display along with the header width. You'll see the custom column fields at the bottom. And you can change the order by simply dragging the field to a new location. You can configure the text for word wrap by checking the box at the bottom. Click on Save and return back to the bill sheet listing. Click on Manage to rename the bill sheet and to edit the optional bill sheet description. You can also manage the hide and unhide feature and manage the templates from here. BillTrack 50 has templates that are used to create a common set of bill sheet column settings across all bill sheets. Once created, any bill sheet using a template will reflect the settings saved to the template automatically. Now back to the bill sheet. To hide a bill from view, just click on the bill and click on the X in the left column. To view the text of the bill, simply highlight the bill and click on the document icon to the left and you'll see the bill summary, including the bill sponsors. By clicking on the bill sponsors, you will get a comprehensive listing of the legislators' sponsored bills, committees in which they serve, staff, bio information. In addition, you'll also see their contact information, their email, phone number, official websites, and even term information. Now back to the bill summary page. You can then read the entire bill text, including all provisions of the bill. Click on Action History to see the entire historical actions of the bill. Click on Voting History to see the yeas and the nays of the legislators. Bill Track 50 also gives you many associated documents with the bill for your reference and for your research. Now back to the bill sheet. Click on the Export button if you'd like to export this bill sheet in Microsoft Excel format. To enter text in the custom column fields, just highlight the bill and then click on the Edit button at the bottom. Enter your text for the fields and click on Submit. A very powerful function is the Filter button at the bottom. Here you can quickly type in further filter criteria. You can click on Query for additional filtering text, searching by sessions, bill sponsors, and bill number. Now let's go to the alerts page. This is a powerful way to have Bill Track 50 track bills and alert you by your laptop or mobile device on changes to the bills, such as new action, new vote, new version, sponsor change, a new bill, and even new associated documents to the bill. Click on the email column for the alerts that you want and click on submit. Now let's have a look at the widget page. A widget is automatically generated code that you can place on your website that will track and display your bill sheet for your users. Bill Track 50 also lets you customize the look and feel of a displayed widget. Create a title, additional filtering if you like, and how many rows to display. Click Test Settings to see the results. You can click on Appearance to customize the border 
background, text colors, and the type of highlights. You can also customize the dimensions of the display box and the sorting of the builds. Once you have your widget designed, just click on Generate Script and BuildTrack50 creates the code for you automatically. Then just have your webmaster copy and paste the code directly into your HTML page. Now let's look at the stakeholder page and select Get Started. You can save time and improve communication with your client with our stakeholder page. Using these special tools, you can share a bill sheet and your related analysis with your clients with a branded website that we even host for you. Stakeholder pages also include conversation threading so you can discuss issues with people you've invited to view your stakeholder page. Using our templates, setting up a page is quick and is easy. First decide what bill sheet will be the source for the stakeholder page. Then fill out your company stakeholder page name, subtitle, and click on Next. You can even add your company logo or image if you like. Then click on Next and agree to the terms to create. To invite users or change settings, click on the Administer page. Here in the General Settings, you can change your page title, subtitle, and logo. Click on Users. Here you can configure your stakeholder page for public access and invite stakeholders. Let's make this one private and invite some stakeholders by the Add Stakeholder button. Simply add their email address and configure their thread and post capabilities and click Add User. You can configure the stakeholder bill sheet column visibility and order by dragging and dropping the column names. Then click Save and the Stakeholder Page button and you'll see the stakeholder page as it will be seen. Your stakeholders also have use of the Filter button at the bottom for additional filtering. Your stakeholders can post comments and respond to discussion threads very easily. There's also a powerful search engine to find a particular discussion. Those are some of the features in the BuildTrack 50 paid subscription. Search and track over 220,000 state and federal bills. Create and save your bill sheets. Set up bill alerts for your mobile devices. Auto-generate bill tracking widgets to install on your website. And build shared stakeholder pages. Thank you for your interest in BuildTrack 50.